my name is Liliana and I'm a student at Carver and at Carver you learn about art. This is some of the art that the art class has done. It's going to be going on display at the Sack Waldorf show and at the Mac show. Interview with Mr. Brittle. Talk about APR. <laughs> uh, we're photographing some APR work to get ready for portfolios that are due in the middle of next week. Um, so APR, we've been teaching it here for 10 years now. Nationwide, there's about a 60% pass rate um, for kids getting credit for college for completing AP portfolios. And overall, my students have had about 80% pass rate, and last year we had 100% pass rate. Um, this year we have a record setting number of 24 kids taking AP art as opposed to 12 last year. I'm um, really looking forward to them getting all their portfolios together, getting the work in, and uh, not having the major stress they're going through in the last couple weeks. Next is Ms. Gorso talking about the Sack Waldorf Art Show. Hi, my name is Suliana. I'm here with Miss Gorso. She teaches English here at Carver. I'm going to be interviewing her about the Sack Water Show. So, Miss Gorso, tell me about what happens at the Sack Water Show. Well, it's part of the May Day Festival at Sack Water, and it was an art show started by a parent and a man who worked at the school named John Mack. And he wanted to have a place where all of the artwork from Northern California art, uh, Waldorf schools could be on display. And so he died a few years ago, and so we renamed it the John Mack um, Art Show in, in his honor. What kind of art do you usually see when you go? Well, a huge variety. So it's opened up to students and faculty and parents and alumni. So you get some professional artists and you get student artwork. There's sculpture, there can be um, textile work, there's two-dimensional fine art, all kinds of... Which one is your favorite? Well, I like it all. I like to see the students' work on display because there's such a um, broad, there's such a variety of artwork. There's curricular artwork, you know, stuff that comes out of main lesson and out of their art classes. But then there's artwork that they do on their own time, which is also really nice to see students inspired, you know, by ideas to create art. So it sounds like the art shows are successful. I think the art shows are successful. And they're, it, the, even the students have an opportunity to sell their artwork, and people who don't even know them will buy their artwork, which I think is a great testament to the love and care. Thank you.